to rework my table because it's not even remotely flat. Might work like that. Maybe. Morning guys. Okay. Went to put on a little bit of hot chocolate this morning. And uh, my grill wasn't didn't have quite enough water. So I went over to refill it up. I put water into it and I went to bear down on it to uh, force it down and it kind of went burp and spit <laughs> around the sides. That's one thing you gotta realize about these pressure is it's an o-ring seal around it you bear down too hard it will spit it back up at you so i'm a little bit wet right now not bad but i got a little spit this morning anyway uh today's video is i just want to say thank you for the people that signed up for my uh fire kit series my fire class for my master wisdom series it was very uh shocking how many people showed up how many people signed up and I'm very very grateful to you for that now I know the people that are in the uh, percussion revolver series they're the ones that's you know Blackie you said there's gonna be one for the percussion revolver how about we talk about that okay this is my third generation reissue Colt 1851 Navy an actual Colt this is the gun that I will be utilizing in this video that's going to be coming up. Now what the percussion revolver video is going to entail is, one, I will talk about the history of the gun, how it came about, and innovations that it brought to the field. Okay. Two, we're then going to do a detailed strip of the gun, go, taking every part, oh, part of, uh, off of the gun and talking about gunsmithing and tips and tricks how you can make improvements like the wire springs that you can get for them etc how you can use a little modern technology a little modern ingenuity to make these much more reliable guns than they were in the original days third we're going to be doing shooting and we're going to be developing a target load a accurate hunting load and then a heavy hunting load for the gun because if we're just shooting holes and paper plates for a match between friends, we want as tight accuracy as we can get because we don't need the power, we want accuracy. On the other hand, whenever I'm using this as a hunting weapon and I'm gonna be hunting small game, I want it to have accuracy and carry a sufficient punch to do the job. And then finally, I want a heavy hunting load. That's when I want the gun to perform at its full potential for use on something heavier like hog from close range out of a stand or something like that so that's where we're going to be going with it now the sign up for the percussion revolver class begins now right here that is the email address you go to and you're going to say 
cap and ball class. Okay, put that in the text, cap and ball class. That way I can put you in a file folder. And that's what I'm doing. You uh, contact me, say you want it. I send you the link for you to pay. And the class will be $10. And the I then take your email and I move it over here into a file folder. On the 1st of December, the 1st of December, I will take the video and drop that video link into that folder, everybody in that folder. And that way you get the video and you can go watch it. That video will be live from December 1 till January 1 and I'm taking that video down. So you have a full month to watch it as many times as you want, memorize it, take notes, however you want to document it, uh, etc. So you can have a copy for you. Some people I know are going to take their phone and get up there and videotape it themselves if they want to do that. Well, you paid your $10. You get that option. And it would be a minimum of a one-hour video. So if you're interested in that and you would like to have a cap and ball revolver, class from me on the 51 Navy, go to this link, and I will send you the PayPal information to pay me for the, the class. This will be the beginning of my percussion revolver book. There's going to be a woodcraft book and a percussion revolver book. So, you know, just hang loose. It is coming. This is how I'm, I'm creating the book. Um, this is the setting up of the chapter, setting up of the dictation so you know where we're going with it. And if you want to sneak peek and get to get to see it before I produce the book, this is how you're going to do it. Um, thank you very much for everything that you've done and the support you've given my channel. Uh, as many of you know, I retired um, from Walmart and YouTube is my sole source of income now. And I'm not going to do Patreon stuff like that. I'm going to do this. That I'm going to produce classes. Every month there will be a Woodscraft class. And for the foreseeable future, starting in December, there will be a Percussion Revolver video until I run out of stuff to talk about that. So between the two, that's going to be the two things I'm going for. And I hope that you would uh, like to see it. Please leave any uh, comments below that you know, ideas you'd like me to go on and or like, could you go more in depth into this or whatever and I'll be happy to, to do it as best I can. Um, thank you very much for all the support, guys. It, it really, you know, from the heart, I mean it, guys. Thank you very much. You're making this dream of mine of being able to share this information a reality and I greatly appreciate it. Well, about time to dump in the chocolate. He's just about to boil. And then I got things I got to do to get the day going. Well, if you don't come from the flame side, it doesn't scorch your knuckles so bad. Sidebar, the titanium cup works pretty good. I've been using it as my uh, primary bushcraft cup and it's done real well. It uh, it heats up faster than a standard stainless steel, that's a fact. It doesn't weigh anything. And as long as you keep those handles pointed away from the fire side, you can pick it up and not scorch your hand. So that down, let that cool off. Okay, I'm going to go enjoy my chocolate now. Thank you very much for supporting my channel, guys. Please hit that like, share, and subscribe button before you go. And tomorrow, there will be another video coming up, and I'll get back on track of posting a video every day as quick as I can. Till next time, guys, I'm Blackie. Wishing you safe journeys. Have a great day, guys.